EMT practice tests. Part 5. 81. Typical components of an oral patient report include all of the following, except a. The chief complaint or mechanism of injury. b. Important medical history, not previously given. c. The set of baseline vital signs taken at the scene. d. The patient's response to treatment you provided. The answer is c. The set of baseline vital signs taken at the scene. 82. As you are wheeling your patient through the emergency department doors, you receive another call for a major motor vehicle crash. You should a. Place the patient in a high visibility area and then respond to the call. b. Inform the admissions clerk of the situation and then respond at once. c. Leave a copy of the run form with a nurse and then respond to the call. d. Respond only after giving a verbal patient report to a nurse or physician. The answer is D. Respond only after giving a verbal patient report to a nurse or physician. 83. You are transporting a 54-year-old male in cardiac arrest. A first responder is driving the ambulance as you and your partner attempt to resuscitate the patient. What is the most logical way of notifying the hospital? A. Call the receiving hospital with your cellular phone as you attempt resuscitation. B. Have the driver contact dispatch and relay the patient information to the hospital. C. Request that a police officer responds to the hospital to apprise them of your arrival. D. Wait until you arrive at the hospital and then quickly apprise them of the situation. The answer is B. Have the driver contact dispatch and relay the patient information to the hospital. 84. When providing a patient report via radio, you should protect the patient's privacy by a. Using coded medical language b. Not disclosing his or her name c. Withholding medical history data d. Refraining from objective statements The answer is b. Not disclosing his or her name 85. Which of the following statements regarding communications with a child is most correct? A. Most children are intrigued by strangers wearing uniforms. B. Give the child minimal information to avoid scaring them. C. Standing over a child often increases their level of anxiety. D. Unlike adults, children cannot see through lies or deceptions. The answer is C. Standing over a child often increases their level of anxiety. 86. Any radio hardware containing a transmitter and receiver that is located in a fixed location is called a a. Repeater b. Multiplex c. Mobile radio d. Base station The answer is d. Base station. 87. Medical control gives you an order that seems inappropriate for the patient's condition. After confirming that you heard the physician correctly, you should a. Carry out the order and then carefully document it on the run form. b. Advise the physician that the order is unclear and ask for clarification. c. State that you will not carry out the order because it is inappropriate. d. Obtain consent from the patient and then carry out the order as usual. The answer is B. Advise the physician that the order is unclear and ask for clarification. 88. Calming and reassuring an anxious patient can be facilitated by A. Maintaining eye contact with the patient whenever possible. B. Using medical terminology to ensure the patient understands. C. Positioning yourself at a level that is higher than the patient. D. Withholding unpleasant information until arrival at the hospital. The answer is A. Maintaining eye contact with the patient whenever possible. 89. Two-way communication that requires the EMTB to push to talk and release to listen describes what mode of communication? A. Duplex. B. Simplex. C. Multiplex. D. Metaplex. The answer is B. Simplex. 90. Which of the following charges can be brought against you if you injure the reputation of a patient by making derogatory remarks? A. Libel. B. Assault. C. Slander. D. 
D. Negligence. The answer is C. Slander. 91. A 37 year old male is found unconscious in his car. His airway is patent and his respirations are rapid and labored. As you and your partner are assessing and treating the patient, a police officer hands you a medication named Allupent, which he found in the back seat of the patient's car. This medication suggests that the patient has a history of A. Asthma B. Heart disease C. Hypertension D. Allergic reactions The answer is A. Asthma 92. When given to patients with cardiac-related chest pain, nitroglycerin A. Relaxes the walls of the coronary arteries B. Increases myocardial contraction force C. Increases blood return to the right atrium D. Constricts the veins throughout the body The answer is A. Relaxes the walls of the coronary arteries 93. Which of the following medication routes delivers a drug through the skin over an extended period of time, such as a nitroglycerin or nicotine patch? A. Sublingual B. Intraosseous C. Subcutaneous D. Transcutaneous The answer is D. Transcutaneous 94. Which of the following is the most rapidly acting medication administration route? A. Sublingual B. Intravenous C. Subcutaneous D. Intramuscular The answer is B. Intravenous 95. Which of the following is an example of a drug's generic name? A. Bayer B. Advil C. Excedrin D. Aspirin The answer is D. Aspirin 96. Shortly after administering epinephrine to a 29-year-old male with an allergic reaction, the patient complains of a fluttering feeling in his chest. This finding is an example of A-slashin. A. Side effect. B. Atypical effect. C. Therapeutic effect. D. Unpredictable effect. The answer is A. Side effect. 97. A 31-year-old female is experiencing an acute asthma attack. She is conscious and alert, but in obvious respiratory distress. After assisting her with her prescribed metered DOS inhaler, you should a. Check the drug's expiration date to ensure that it is still current. b. Contact medical control and apprise him or her of what you did. c. Reassess the patient and document her response to the medication. D. Administer another treatment in 30 seconds if she is still in distress. The answer is C. Reassess the patient and document her response to the medication. 98. A 49-year-old male with an extensive cardiac history presents with two hours of crushing chest pain and shortness of breath. He is pale and diaphoretic and tells you that he feels like he's going to die. His medications include nitroglycerin, nitro, Viagra, and Vasotec. His blood pressure is 140-90 mmHg and his heart rate is 110 beats min. In addition to administering 100% oxygen, you should a. Obtain physician approval to give the nitroglycerin. b. Place him in a supine position and transport at once. c. Administer one nitroglycerin and call medical control. D. Ask him if he took his Viagra within the past 24 hours. The answer is D. Ask him if he took his Viagra within the past 24 hours. 99. The process of binding or sticking to a surface is called A. Adsorption B. Absorption C. Suspension D. Digestion The answer is A. Adsorption 100. Which of the following medication routes has the slowest rate of absorption? A. Rectal B. Ingestion C. Inhalation D. Sublingual The answer is B. Ingestion